So have y'all got a few hauls to share with you guys? I, <laughs> I actually wasn't even expecting to have any hauls to share with you guys today. But I ended up getting some things. That's kind of how it goes though. If I end up hitting a Ross or you know any of the other discount stores, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, DD's discounts, um, usually Ross or DD's discounts, I'm I'm usually gonna find something. TJ Maxx, Marshalls, it's chances are usually slimmer there. But yeah, it, it just goes that way. I end up finding several things. Um, yeah. So, I got a few things. Uh, but before I jump into these hauls, hauls of the day, I want to give you guys a quick, closer look at this um, Mega Constructs Hero Series 3 Leonardo. Um, so, you might have seen it. You know, I, I, I showed the video where I um, saw found this and the others in store. And there was the, uh, the haul video as well, but so I, I was was kind of you know thinking of doing a review, but I was just too excited. I had to crack it open. I man, this this might be my favorite of the uh, any of the Mega Blocks, Mega Constructs, and Ninja Turtles. I hope that they do the rest of the team. I love this classic. Um, you know, a uh, comic version. Uh, I wasn't crazy. I know they, they did a few sets with the uh, the black and white. Um, and, you know, that's how the comics were. They were black and white, with the exception of covers and stuff, of course. But, you know, I, for me, I kind of, like, had no use for the black and white versions. I, I loved the style with the lines and everything. But I, I really wanted them in color. So when we have a Leo, but it's almost like, I mean, I, I'm, I'm happy to have this Leo. Look at those, look at those lines. Um, regardless, but I do hope we get the rest of the turtles. This thing's amazing. <laughs> this is a must have. I, I highly recommend this one. You know, this is, you know, this is the, the most I'm going to show it since I probably won't do a review, but there you have it. So anyway, let's, uh jump into these hauls so most most of the stuff is from ross but earlier in the day i went to a, a dollar tree just to get some um what did i forget i needed it just to get something um but ended up finding a couple dvds iron man armored adventures season two volume three i think i've seen a couple episodes of this um but i haven't seen a whole lot so pretty cool there's there's a few episodes, but it looks like there might be some really cool episodes here. So I'm actually going to probably try to watch this maybe tonight or something. But, um, and this, Hoodwinked. <laughs> I've never seen this. Uh, I, I kind of only vaguely remember this being out. One of those things where I probably wasn't really interested, but... When it boasts something like the funniest animated movie since Shrek. Well, at the time, anyway. What year did this come out? 2005. Wow, that's old. Or 2006. I didn't realize this movie was that old. But when it boasts that, you know, it's, I'm thinking it should be at least kind of entertaining. And some some big names. Jim Belushi, Glenn Close, Anne Hathaway. I love Anne Hathaway. Patrick Warburton. I like him. Exhibit. That should be interesting. Anthony Anderson. That name escapes me right now, but for a buck, why not? And then on to some stuff from Ross. So I actually got this for summer, um, which um, I'm not going to give it to her yet. I'm going to ask my wife if, uh, you know, we, we try not to spoil her. We don't. We don't spoil her. Um, but you know, once in a while when there's something we know she likes, you know, we'll, we'll treat her and usually we'll, we'll do it as a surprise. Cause she's all, you know, I, she's always with me when I'm in the stores and she's always seeing stuff that she wants, but you know, I'm like, nope, you, you don't get something just, just for no reason, you know, mostly special occasions or, you know, here and there. And again, like we'll, we'll surprise her with something. 
uh, now and then. But um, she does like these cutie cars, and she only has like, I think two of them. We bought her one, you know, because they're expensive. They're like five bucks each. We bought her one a while back, and then the bro, Kyle, uh, everything is awesome TV, the geeky brony. He uh, he sent her one for Christmas, um, and that that's been it. And she loves them. And she loves Shopkins, and yeah, we we know she'd be happy to have some. It's just like you know, there's no need to to spoil her with these, but. I saw these at Ross for $6.99. Given that one is like five bucks to get three of them for $6.99. And one of them is an exclusive. I don't know which car exactly is exclusive, but they're all pretty cool. So I'll ask my wife first, though. You know, I mean, it's still seven bucks. Seven bucks is not a whole lot, but it's still seven bucks. And it's like if, if she feels like, eh, she doesn't need these, I'm like, okay, I'll return it. It's seven bucks, you know? Anyway, moving right along. <laughs> I couldn't resist this. I just, I, you know, it's, it's an Airhogs um, micro race drone, ultimate indoor racing drone, official partner of DR1 Racing, Luke Bannister edition. So I don't really know about DR1 Racing. I mean, I know there's there's all these drone racing leagues, and it's a thing now. But, and it's, you know, it's a little micro one. I thought, man, this is good. This looks like fun. And I'm all about toys that are fun. You know, you know me. I'm not just all about action figures and, and building sets. I love building sets and action figures, but I love fun toys that you can just play with and have fun. So, 17 bucks. I said, ah, man, this looks like fun. I, I want it. I want to get it. So, uh, matter of fact, after I, <laughs> I turn this off, I'm going to throw some batteries in here and, and test this thing out ASAP. And then, another Mad Constructs Ninja Turtle set. This is the Nickelodeon one. Leo Turtle Glider Pursuit. And I mainly just got it for the Bebop figure. I already have a few Leos in my Nick Turtles collection. Um, but this is a nice addition. Um... You know, I'm not a completist for most things I collect. Um, and I'm not going to be a completist first line, but I do want most of the sets. There's a few I, I can live without, like these little go-kart sets and stuff. But anything that's kind of like a, a structure or playset type thing. And I have most of them. I have a majority of them already. But there's still a few out there. Never, never saw that little set or that. I feel like that those were those were like on the tail end and didn't really hit stores. So if I could find those, I'd love to get them. But I miss this big like Robo Turtle thing. I can live without that. But I do have. I, I want to say I have a majority of the sets, and I'm happy with what I have. But I would still love to get uh, a few of those other ones, mainly those two actually. And then last but not least. Man, this was a score. Big thanks to the bro Chris Rexlex All 69. He gave me the heads up. Not just that the, this was at Ross, but exactly which location it was at. He told me uh, in the morning that he'd found it. And I was like, oh, I need that. I need that. I didn't see the message. Maybe if I would have caught him while he was still in the store, I could ask him to pick it up for me. I didn't see the message as in our group message till a little later. Um, and I was just hoping, you know, I couldn't, I couldn't just get out up and go, you know, I'm watching my daughter and stuff. And anyway, I was like, okay, <laughs> I hope it's still there. You know, after I was going to be able to go after dropping my wife off at work. Look at that. $12.99 for this set. I've been wanting this. So I collect, there's another one that, I'm not necessarily a completist of, but honestly, I would like all the sets. And I think I have most of them now. I don't have this still. And a few of these smaller sets with just like the figures. Um, but I have a majority of the, the, the main sets, uh, with the exception of this, and now with this, this layer. Oh man, 
what it scored, $12.99. I remember how much this originally was, but I want to say it was at least around 40 bucks, maybe more. And I haven't seen it for less than like 30 something on Amazon, which is where I've been watching it for, for a while now. Just waiting to catch it for a really good price, but boom. 12 freaking 99 comes with four figures, including a, a shredder and a, a foot ninja. Really cool set. That's one of those things where, honestly, like it looks like there's more going on, you know, and then you build it and it's like, eh, it's only so much, but I still feel like for what it is, there's kind of a lot going on and it's a good size. It's not one of those things that's gonna be really undersized and I feel like it's well worth the 12 bucks. Like, I, I feel like at 20 bucks it would have been still a good price. I would have I would have grabbed it at 20, but 12.99, hells yeah. So again, big thanks to the bro, Chris, Rexflex all 69 for the heads up. Man, so excited. I, I wanna build this like right away, so. There you have it, drone. Cutie cars, DVDs, Leo. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, thanks so much. Really appreciate it. 